welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be the of what I got from Disney World and what I got from Universal. Um, I'm very proud of myself. I did not spend <laughs> as much as I thought I would, but which means I just spent most of my money on food. <laughs> um, anyways, if you would like to see what I got from Universal, Disney World, all of the theme parks from Disney, then just keep on watching. I'm gonna start with Universal because I love Universal and you guys already know, you already know. The first thing that I had to pick up is their reusable bags. These are so cute. I'm so happy they came out with them. This is the large one. I almost picked up the smaller one, but I just thought I already have, if I have the big one, I really don't need a smaller one. And I cannot wait to put this in my car. So, and then I also picked it up a smaller one when I got off of the Spider Man ride. One of my favorite rides ever. It's so fun and just, just a really fun ride. So, this is just the universal reusable bag. This is the smaller one. They also have a bigger one, but I just decided to get the smaller one. So I have those. I also picked up a Marvel keychain, which looks like this. It's currently downstairs and I really don't feel like running downstairs to go get it, but that is what it looks like and I love it so much. So I only picked up one thing from Harry Potter World, which is insane. You guys should be so proud of me. <laughs> and that is Ron Weasley's wand. This is the interactive one. Um, I don't really care for if the wand is interactive or not. Um, I'm still going to bring them when I go. So now I already have Hermione's and I have Ron's and I have Fred's. So now the last one that I really wanna get is Harry. So I might get that one next time I go. So this is the interactive wand and it is so cool i've wanted ron's wand for the longest time and this is just the detailing it is a very light weight oh just feels so light and i think it is so cute because ron just keeps breaking his wand in every movie and can't afford to get it fixed so i just really love it so that was the main thing that i wanted from harry potter and then, of course, it has all the spots in Diagon Alley and in Hogsmeade where you can do all the spells and make things move and whatnot. And it's really cute. I did not pick up any candy or anything from Honeydukes, although I wanted to. My group just didn't want to stand in line, so I just decided to opt out from that so that is all that i got from wizarding world of harry potter um which i'm fine with the wand was 60 60 dollars now usually they're 50 but with prices increasing it's 60 dollars and then i also got like the wand bag for two dollars but i threw it away so yeah <laughs> which is weird because now you have to pay for the wand bag which when last time i went you didn't have to the next place that I went to is Disney Springs. That's where my sister, um, her high school band performed and it was so cool. Um, and so I just went shopping. I did a little damage. I bought some things from Lululemon, which I will do a separate video later because I just posted one and I really don't want to post one two weeks in a row. So you will see that soon. But yeah, I really wanted to go to Ron John because Ron John is like the best place to go when you go to Florida. It's just like the surfer shop, very fun, good vibes all around. And that's just some place you need to stop when you go to Florida. So the first thing that I picked up is this yellow shirt. So cute. This is the detail on this side pocket. And then this is the back. It is just so cute. I got this in a large. I sized up because it's 100% cotton and 100% cotton shrinks. I bought my boyfriend a t-shirt and it is so cute. It's just like it has the same pocket thing but it's blue and this is the back. So I sized up on his too. I got him a medium just so it doesn't shrink too much. And last thing I got myself was a crew neck because it's always cold. And this is just a regular dark gray with blue and looks like this. So I got this in a large so I can sleep in it. And I'm really excited about this. 
Oh, I also got a sticker that I will probably put on my car or my computer. I don't know yet. And then I got a normal Ron John sticker that I will be putting on my car. So, okay, I'm back. I had to take a quick break because my dogs are barking. On Thursday, we went to Epcot and you know, I'm gonna make a whole video about my Disney trip because it was a hot mess, but I did not like Epcot. And this is the second time I've been to Epcot. It was horrible. It was a horrible experience. So Friday we went to Magic Kingdom and that's where like the castle is and everything. And you guys, I did not like Magic Kingdom at all. And this is what I bought. I bought a cheetah print mini mouse ears and I think they are so cute. We rode the Haunted Mansion, which, which was really fun. And that's about it. <laughs> um, but I also picked up these ears at Magic Kingdom and they are so cute. These are the basic black and red sequined mini ears. Um, now let me tell you, all the Disney parks were sold out of everything cute. Like these were the cutest, besides the cheetah print, these were the cutest ears they had. They are the cutest ears I had. They didn't, have, they didn't have anything new, limited edition nothing and I'm very upset because it seems like the pass holders or the people who actually live down there literally buy everything out of the stores as soon as everything drops and then us who visit are just SOL because they buy everything so these were the only two ears I got and yeah so although I do really like them it's just really sad that I could not pick up the Mickey waffle ears that I wanted and also the emerald ones so then I bought a bag because I thought it is so cute for the 50, 50th anniversary and I also bought a Mickey reusable popcorn bucket which is really cute it's downstairs though but so that's what it looks like that's pretty much it I did not buy much which is really good but I also spent so much money on food I tried a bunch of stuff the popcorn was not as good as I thought it would be um maybe because I got it like literally right when they were closing that's probably why but it was good it was fine so yeah that's pretty much everything <laughs> that I got from Universal and Disney World, all the theme parks. If you guys enjoyed this video, if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you in my next video.